Dirk, are you here, my boy? It's time for our cup. My goodness! These paintings must have cost you a fortune. So? I'm Dirk Runny. Dirk, I warned you to be more careful with your finances. Our film will be fiscally feasible, but we do need some resources. Now, how much have you left? Uh-oh. I'm broke. It's your fault. My fault? You didn't warn me enough. That's preposterous. Why didn't you warn me enough? Please, let's step outside. I believe I have a solution for all of this. You see, as I mentioned before, matter creation is quite possible in this world. By forming and combining basic shapes like these cylinders, we can create items. Items whose designs we may sell to others for great wealth. Why, look, just this morning I... No, I know how to make money. Dirk, wait! Uh... My old agent told me I shouldn't gamble anymore. But he didn't know I was gonna be broke. It's his fault, too. Let's hit it, blue dude. The cash man cometh. Slot machines? Best odds, blue dude. You must be joking. If you insist on gambling, at least engage in a game which involves some level of skill. Oh, gracious, even roulette. No way. Real men know how to handle the handle. Watch. You lost. No fair. It's broken. I'm going to yell at the manager. Hmm, a dollar. Delightful. He said it's not broken. He's a liar. My boy, I just won. No, you didn't. You're lying, too. I am not lying. Besides, you're not going to become wealthy betting a single dollar at a time. Wrong, blue dude. Because if we win, I'll just tell him we meant to bet a million dollars. Cool, huh? I'm leaving. I'll be at the cafe pondering a leading lady. You're lost, chicken man. No fair. No fair. No fair. Indeed. I'm certain that given the current depth of his illness, such an event could not possibly serve to further exacerbate his condition. All right, if you're sure. Thanks, doctor. Hi. Welcome back. I've just been consulting with our mental health expert, Dr. Julia Hopkins, on a possible cure for Bernie. Now, as you'll recall, Bernie has been traumatized by recent events and, as a result, forgotten spoken language. However, the doctor feels that Bernie can actually understand language, but that he just can't speak it. She believes that by placing Bernie in an emotionally volatile situation, it might actually force him to flash recall words in a desperation to communicate. Anyway, this all makes sense in a minute. Val, you ready? Yes, Dave. Then patch me in. Hi, Bernie. Gobble, gibby, gobble, uh, Bernie, I have something really important to talk to you about today, okay? Togo, wogo? Okay, now, Bernie, I need you Dave, to... I am sorry to interrupt, but I am experiencing a problem with oxygen flow in the hub. The... <gasps> You're right. I'm having trouble. Okay. Oxygen supply will fully deplete in six seconds. No. no. I'm sorry, Dave. No! Look out! Run! No, Bernie! No, no, look! Look, I'm okay. You it's okay. See? Out. See, it's me. <sighs> Brother. Val, can you get Dr. Hopkins on the line, please? Yes, Dave. I'd kind of like to keep this private. Do we have anyone who can... Cliff is available, Dave. Cliff the plumber? Yes, Dave. He claims to have a significant report. Great. Yes, so here is a report on plumbing. Hello, I'm Cliff. I am a plumber specializing in restrooms, restroom areas, and restroom-related devices. 
As to how I originally met Dave from Portal, <laughs> he would be upset if I imparted this information to you. Therefore, just allow me to say never attempt to flush a flight suit down a hotel toilet. <laughs> Now, about The Sims. In this world, it is important to be aware of your bladder and hygiene and such at all times, as indicated by these meters here. If you let them sink, for example, into the red, bad and humiliating results can occur. Poor guy. By maintaining a good toilet and using it properly, you can be happy like myself and other well-adjusted individuals such as myself. This is the most basic toilet available, but there are many others which will serve your needs better. For example, the Bugs Memorial Commode will not only help your functions, but is aesthetically pleasing as well. Some toilets, such as this Flush Force 5, contain an auto-flush feature, saving you valuable seconds in your busy day. High-end toilets, such as this model, will not only serve to relieve your needs, but will increase your comfort level as well. Showers are equally important to a well-balanced individual. This most basic unit will assist your hygiene needs. But remember, there are many models available, such as this chrome version with deluxe massage features to help relax your person. For true relaxation, as well as additional bonuses to your comfort meter, try one of the Sims many fine tubs. Ah, I wish I were relaxing in a luxurious bathtub right now. Please remember, all bathroom appliances must be cleaned regularly or a possible penalty might appear as a result of your irresponsibility and neglect. The bathroom is a critical tool for all citizens of The Sims Online. Use it in good health and please, do not become one of the few individuals who so chooses to perverse the bathroom, turning it into a chamber of filth and disgrace. Now, if you will excuse me, at this time, I myself have to use the restroom. Take care now. Welcome to the jungle. This ain't fun and games. Luckily, I was here on business. In recent days, I discovered I was being followed. Missed my chance to catch her wasn't sure if I still was. So now it was time to fight fire with fire. I hired a professional tracker to trail me at an extreme distance and keep an eye out for anyone else who was tailing me. A stalker for my stalker. It was expensive, but good noses are hard to come by. My job was to play stupid and make myself an easy target which meant a lot of naps out in the open. Should have been easy enough. I hadn't slept in weeks. But then, I had the dream. Oh, oh. the drifter. This is my lucky day. Don't be shy. Let me take you someplace where I can help you relax. Don't be shy. Just a little kiss. Don't be shy. Just a little I'm gonna keep you all to myself. Don't, don't be shy. shy. I've had a dungeon fantasy about you for a long, long time. I'm not just all muscles. Great bomb. Don't, don't be shy. shy. Just a little kick. Ah! She was in my head. Bad. It made no sense. It had been ages since I'd had time for romance. And when I did, the last thing I'd ever be thinking about is a two-ton homicidal Lusian. It was sorcery. Evil sorcery. Plain and simple. I called in my tracker. Here, the rest of your fee. I don't understand. Change of plan. Where I'm going, you won't survive. <laughs> don't be so sure. Where are you headed? To hell. Greetings, Master. He still believes you follow him. You should have shown more caution. I am sorry, Master. If you had not been so careless, he would surely one day have led us to Dave. Now we must find another to take us to him. The Drifter is far too dangerous now that he is aware. Who do you wish me to shadow next? None. I shall seek out Dave on my own. 
No longer shall I leave these important matters to my pupils. Go, young one. Live, play, and pray for your master that the fates may one day bring her to the hub. Hi. Welcome back to the hub. I was just about to connect to Gruder and see how he's doing in his new home on Tatooine. Val? Patching now, Dave. Oh, hey, Dave! Gr Gruder, be careful with that. Look what I got! Fun, huh? It's a blaster! Watch this! <laughs> <laughs> See? It's much more neato than a sword, huh? Some nice fella gave it to me. I can't remember his name. I think it done rhymed with Bolo or Yolo. Well, anyway, it's super duper, huh? Yeah, it looks pretty. Oh, Dave! Tatooine is so much fun! Come on! I got to show you some of the dandy things I done find. Follow me! Lead on. This here is my favorite place. It's a palace in the middle of the desert. There's some famous fella in there named Jabo the Foot. He done got this little guy who sits on his lap and giggles. This is silly. And then there's these little guys too. They sell all kinds of good stuff. Woo-wee! Look how big their buggy is! I bet you could fit about 40 hogs in there! Well, they don't have hogs on Tatooine, but they got duckies! Mm -mm. I can't wait to try one of them! And looky here, at this! A cantina! They got funny sounding music in here, but see? I learned me to dance real cultured like. La dee da dee da dee da 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 Now this here's a transport shuttle. They say it doesn't go to other planets. If you, hey, it's moving. Fellas, where are we going? Fellas, fellas. Uh-oh, my name. You know, I got a bad feeling about that. Thanks, Val. Certainly, Dave. Well, that just about does it for today. If you want more information, you can log on to g4tv.com slash portal, or just wait until the next transmission. We'll see you then. What are you doing? My love, merely relieving myself of a little aggression. I am most... Idiot. We must focus our energies on the plan. The first phase must soon be completed. I am aware of that, woman. Do not insult my intelligence. Our employer has clearly stated that... He has stated that any delay could result in failure. And failure, in turn, punishment. I will not suffer for your incompetence, husband. The prize will be mine. I seek the prize as much as you, wench. Enough bickering. Let us proceed to work. Yes, yes, of course. Let the gathering begin. No, no fear. No fear. Whoa, no fear. That's Bill. No, no fear. This is stupid. No. It's broken. Manager, I want my fuzzy yuzzy. More servings of Portal, coming up next on G4's Overindulgence Weekend. Hold the butter, please. <laughs>